Hey guys, welcome back. Now, it's taken us a while to review uh, smart home security products, uh, but right now I have two products from Arlo's essential line of security devices. So we have here the Arlo Essential Spotlight Camera and the Arlo Essential Video Doorbell Wire Free. So first up, the camera. Now in the box, you get obviously the camera, you get a charging cable, you get a quick start guide, as well as a wall mount and a screw kit. Now for the video doorbell, you get the doorbell, you get a rechargeable battery that you see over here, uh, you get your regular quick start uh, guide, you get this, uh, security release pin and of course you get your wall mount which is actually two you get a flat and an angle wall mount uh, as well as your cable to charge and of course just like the camera you get a full screw kit so that you can mount it to your wall or your door now first of all like I said they are smart home products so yes they work with basically the entire line uh, of smart assistants so like your Google Home Apple home kit smart things uh, IFTTT and of course your Amazon ALEXA now, I think Arlo actually deserves some commendation for actually giving you two types of wall mounts for the video doorbell. Like I said, you get a flat and a uh, angled one as well. Now, it's really great. You know, it, it makes it so much easier to find the perfect place to install uh, your video doorbell. And the fact that it's angled and you can actually install it either way means that you can actually angle it both ways. Now, design-wise, both of them get an A. They look really modern, they look kind of stylish, but at the same time, they don't stand out too much in your setup. Now, they also get an A for usability, both in the hardware as well as the app. And we'll talk about the app later, but I love the fact that it's so easy to set up. Plus the fact that they're both sort of wireless, they both have their own power supply as well. That means you don't have to run wires all the way into your house. And yes, you don't even need to hire an electrician to set it up for you. Now, having said that, I do wish there was a way to better secure this camera to your setup. Now for the video doorbell, you do need a, a specific pin like this one to remove it if you want to replace your battery or whatever. But for this, basically all you have to do is unscrew it. And because it's not wired, anyone could kind of walk away with it. Now, actually, if you look on Amazon, I did find some third party uh, products like cables and chains to sort of, you know, secure it to wherever you installed it in your home. Uh, but honestly, I do feel that Arlo should have included it in the box. Now, in terms of battery life, both of them last a whopping six months, or at least Arlo has rated them for six months. Now, I'm very sure that, you know, that sort of mileage may vary depending on how you've configured the cameras, and we'll talk about that later. But not only that, like, depending on how many times it gets activated, uh, I'm sure that also affects the battery life. But having said that, an average lifespan of about six months on full battery is quite impressive. Now, the battery for the Spotlight camera is built in and you've got a USB port at the bottom to charge it. However, the video doorbell battery can actually be removed, which is great. And you don't even need a dock to charge it. It basically has its own USB port, which makes things so much easier. Now, in terms of powering up the Spotlight camera, you also have the option for a solar panel. Now, yeah, Arlo actually uh, cells like a solar panel that you can connect to this to provide power. Now, that solar panel is rated for the Arlo Essential Spotlight camera. There is no mention of it working on the video doorbell, so I don't think it will work on that. Now, like I said, installing either of these devices is really easy, although I do want to mention one thing. Now, I have installed both the camera as well as the video doorbell in the front of my house. Now, I just want to mention that I live in an apartment. I don't live in like a big house with like a backyard and all that. So technically for my specific use, I actually think the video doorbell is sufficient because I have a single point of entry. But yeah, if you live in like a big house and you've got backyards or multiple points of entry, then you definitely want to get one or more of these cameras uh, installed around your house. But for the sake of this review and to test out these products, I've installed both of them right in front. Now, the video doorbell has a very pronounced fish eye lens, uh, basically to allow it to pick up a wide an area as possible. Now, not only that, having this sort of fish eye lens allows it to work uh, just as well, even if you have a gate in front of your door. So to demonstrate that, I actually installed this directly on my door and not to the wall at the side of the door, just to show this. So if you look at the videos here, so if it had a regular lens, the bars of the gate would actually block and not give you a clear enough view uh, of who's pressing the doorbell or who's standing in front of your door. But because you have that fish eye lens, it's almost like as if it bends the bars around and you can actually see who's there very clearly. Now, one thing that Arlo has done, which I think is basically brilliant, is the fact that the aspect ratio 
is actually square, so it's one by one. Now, most videos have an aspect ratio of four by three or even 16 by nine, uh, but this is square, so it's one by one. And because it has such a wide field of view, it will basically pick whoever's at your front door from head to toe. So in terms of video capture, you actually get three different modes, which is basically three different uh, resolutions. So you, at full resolution, it is uh, 1536 by 1536, or you can scale it down to 1080 by 1080, or 720 by 720. Now the essential spotlight camera, it this shoots actually at 16 by 9, but at 1080p, so it shoots full HD. But this still has a very wide viewing angle. This has a field of view of 130 degrees. So both of these devices actually support low light or even night vision. But unfortunately for the video doorbell, I wasn't really able to test it out that well because my corridor is very well lit. So even at night, there really is no need for night vision. But what I did was, is I actually took the spotlight camera and I put it in my living room and I you know, pointed it to my living room and I turned off the lights to see how it would be at night. And yeah, the night vision is really impressive. Everything was still really clear. Now moving on to some of the value added features of uh, both these products. Now, both of these can be controlled via the Arlo app, which is available both on iOS and Android. And yeah, you will actually need that app uh, to set up the device, to configure it how you want, and then things like, you know, setting your zones and one where you want it to be triggered, all of that, you definitely will need the app. But having said that, I have to say, I'll do a really good job on the app and the whole setup process. It is one of the easiest and simplest setups I have ever done on any smart home device. But yeah, on the app, you will also be able to control a whole load of different uh, features. And one of my favorites is the motion alerts, and it actually is able to detect it according to the type. So whether it's a person, a vehicle, an animal, it's able to differentiate between all of these. That is incredible in itself. Now, earlier on, I mentioned about how you can create zones. And yes, you can create zones on both of these devices. So basically, if this is pointing to one area uh, that has a lot of movement regularly, like if there are a lot of animals or if there are trees that move a lot or constantly you have vehicles driving by, you can set an active zone so that only if there is movement within that zone, then you get a notification. Now, also through the Arlo app, as well as the website. So you can go to the Arlo website, uh, you can log in and you actually have the same features and configurations as you do on the app. Now, what both of these devices do is that if you get a notification, it at the same time, it also records a 30 second clip of that movement. So if you wanna go through all the footage, you can actually see which ones that are important to you. You can download them. And actually, Arlo saves all of those uh, videos for 30 days on their servers. Now, there's a catch. A lot of features that I mentioned uh, actually requires you to sign up for a subscription plan. Okay, so Arlo has something called uh, Arlo Smart Subscription Plan. Uh, and there are different tiers depending on the number of devices that you have. Now, you can actually use this without a subscription plan, but especially for the Spotlight camera, if you don't sign up for any of the plans, it's basically just a streaming camera. So the Arlo Essential uh, Spotlight camera uh, is available at about 199 Singapore dollars. And for the video doorbell, it comes in at about 329 Singapore dollars. And yes, of course, this does not include the subscription plan. Now, if you've seen my series of videos called the Affordable Smart Home, uh, you realize that, you know, I always prioritize and I put in high regard getting good products at a very cheap price. But you will also realize that I have never featured on that series a video doorbell or a camera. Now, the reason is simple. When you're talking about the security of yourself, of your home, of your family members, your priority should not be getting the cheapest one available. What you do look for is something that's well built, will last, has all the features that you need. And then, of course, you look for something that's worth the money. But I have to say, as far as all of the features that are concerned, including the subscription plan, including all the features, I would have to say Arlo has basically nailed it. All right, so that about wraps up my review of the Arlo Essential Spotlight Camera and the Video Doorbell Wire Free. Now, if you like this video, you know what to do, and I would love it if you would subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to receive notifications on our next video. I'm JP, and I'll see you real soon.